Understanding, I'm astonished. A guide for English learners. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, I'm astonished. This phrase is a fantastic example of expressing surprise or amazement in English. Let's dive in and understand what it really means and how you can use it in your daily conversations. I'm astonished is an expression used to convey that you are extremely surprised or amazed by something. It's stronger than just saying, I'm surprised, and is often used in situations where something unexpected has happened, or someone has done something remarkable. This phrase can convey positive surprise, like being pleasantly surprised, or negative surprise, such as shock or disbelief. Let's look at some examples to see how, I'm astonished, can be used in different contexts. 1. Positive surprise, I'm astonished at how well you've learned to speak English in such a short time. 2. Negative surprise, I'm astonished that the team lost the game after such a strong start. 3. Neutral context, seeing the Grand Canyon for the first time, I was simply astonished. Understanding synonyms can expand your vocabulary. Here are some alternatives. Amazed, astounded, stunned, flabbergasted. Each of these words can be used in slightly different contexts, but they all convey a strong sense of surprise. This phrase is best used in formal or semi-formal situations. It's perfect for expressing strong emotions in speeches, presentations, or writing. However, in casual conversations, simpler phrases like, I'm shocked, or, wow, might be more common. It's important to note that this phrase might be interpreted differently in various cultures. In some contexts, it could be seen as overly dramatic. It's always good to be aware of the tone and setting when using such expressive language. We hope this video helps you understand and use the phrase, I'm astonished, confidently in your English conversations. Remember, learning a new language is all about practice and exploration. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to express your surprise in English using this phrase. See you in our next video.